Israel says it has agreed to a ceasefire. Tel Aviv, Israel The Israeli government said it had agreed to a ceasefire in its conflict with Hamas late Thursday after 11 days of violence that saw over 200 Palestinians and 12 Israelis killed in the worst fighting in the region in years. The announcement came after a meeting of Israel's security cabinet. There had been increasing speculation by Israeli media outlets on Thursday that a ceasefire to end the deadly conflict with Hamas and other armed groups in the Gaza Strip could come within a day. But as the U.S. and others increased pressure on Israel to stop its devastating assault on the Palestinian enclave, the bombing continued, as did the steady stream of rocket fire at Israel. During a phone call on Wednesday, President Joe Biden told his Israeli counterpart Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu that he expected a significant de-escalation today on the path to a ceasefire. But Israeli officials, including Netanyahu himself, made it clear that their military mission was to completely stop the rockets flying out of Gaza by force, and that the mission hadn't yet been completed. A senior Hamas official appeared to agree with the more optimistic reports in the Israeli media however, 